What is happening guys? Cowboy here. Welcome back to Vampire. And I finally changed my fucking outfit. Took forever. Uh, but finally realized it was the locker instead of a, a trunk. I was looking for a trunk or something. But either way, let's get going. Let's analyze this blood. Find out uh, what we know. Craft up one of those bad boys while we're at it. You know what? It'd probably be good to carry around some of this stuff. Pretty sure there was somebody with bronchitis I met earlier. Still, I need to find the headache treatment. Because I could probably make the shit I need, but I gotta find it first. It's increased stamina regen. Oh, that's nice, but not really that needed. Vasily was infected by Spanish flu, but also has the highly unstable blood of the Skulls. Is the London vampire epidemic transmitted through the flu? I should talk to Dr. Swansea about it. Oh, no. Ooh, vampires. And hey, we're on to chapter three. Well, we got 2,400 XP, so it is definitely level up time. Can I go here yet? 3,000 and... Oh, so close. Throw a large blood spear, which can pass through enemies in front of you. So that'll be 300 blood damage. Costs 30. That'll be 270 blood damage, three blood spears. I don't know which one I want. I don't know. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a link to a poll on this video. Um, I'll let you guys vote on it, and then probably on like Sunday's episode, I will pick one of those upgrades. In the meantime, let's upgrade this. I mean, for this one, I'm probably going for this. Just because uh, creating a pool of shadows that'll damage people over a large area, that sounds really cool to me. Um, especially the whole vampire will directly absorb, absorb the blood from the wounds. I like that. Um, whereas a big shadow mist explosion, like, yeah, it's neat and all, but do I really need that? No. You know what I mean? Anyway, let's do... Um... Ooh. 100% damage on that bite. Or do I want to heal via bite? Heal via bite is always nice, I think. Let's see. This is up to lots of blood. Could also increase my blood capacity. No, I cannot. I don't have enough. Um. Oh, wait. I can get an ultimate. Shit. How much do these cost? Cost a thousand. Alright, hold up. Uh... Yep, cancel. I'm getting an ultimate ability. Do, 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 All right, let's see. Uh, you lose control and let the beast take over for a short time. Beast teleports itself to all enemies and strikes them with flurry, furious blows. Also, while we're here, um, that goes from 20 damage to 40. Yep. All right. Um, let's see. So, 200 damage, teleport around, hit stuff. You create a shadow vortex at your target's feet. Coming to life, the shadow interrupts an enemy in the area and inflicts tremendous damage. So, 200 hits everybody. 600 big dick damage. 400 blood. You're boiled to boil the target's blood to violently explode, dealing damage to the target. So, 400 blood damage and then 230 to everything nearby. Whereas this is just, let me, can I, is there like a way to, to look at these? The rage looks kind of stupid. It looks like you do some like bleach type shit. You just teleport around hitting people. This looks badass. It's literally a shadow coming out of the ground and impaling by a massive thing. Interrupts an enemy in the area. So basically, hit everybody for 200, massive damage for 600, or big damage to a ton of people around. Finally, explode, ding ding to the target, anything. I, I feel like I got decent AoE with Shadow Mist. Let's go for Abyss, because that's a big single target nuke. The idea of a big single target nuke. Uh, is very appealing to me. And we will 
get some health as we bite people. Alright. Something's happening. The district has fallen into serious. Pippa Hawkins has gone missing. Oh no, Pippa. Well, Milton was kind of a dick. That had to happen. Um, I can treat you. Your booth are gonna get eaten. I can treat anemia. I can treat your fatigue. Can't eat you yet. I can treat, so let me see. Hang on, we're about to do some serious fucking treatment here. Um, cold. Fatigue, fatigue, anemia, fatigue, 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 was it one, two, three fatigue, four fatigue, four fatigue, and then there's one, two, two anemia, one headache, one cold. Fatigue. Was it four, three fatigue? God damn it, I'm trying to keep track of everything and I'm... Causes and effects. Alright, let's see. Fatigue, 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 cold. I think there was, uh, two anemia. Fatigue, 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 anemia, cold. I think that's everybody. Alright. Let's see. Gwyneth Brannigan. You need to stay healthy, my dear. Good evening. You are Good gonna evening. be one of the, uh... Do you require med- I will be... Nurse. You... I'll try. Alright, there we go. She gonna be healthy. Good evening. Do you need any medical? Come on. I, can I take tippets? <gasps> Goodbye, doctor. I can take tippets, but if I go for tippets... I'm probably gonna lose Nurse Brannigan. So even though I want Tippets, Brannigan is at five. I'll need to to get up before Tippets becomes a snack. Ah, you are healthy, Mr. Cox. Hey, <laughs> Doc. I've been meaning to talk to you about the uh, wet boot boys lately. Seems they have been causing a lot of trouble. You being so familiar with this group of people, obviously you're a central figure in this trouble. And as you know, being a new doctor in a area, the last thing I need is trouble. Trouble is just not good, Clay. You gotta understand. Uh, I'm a very prestigious doctor. I have a, a long background on blood transfusion. Are you curious about blood transfusion? I am quite an expert in the field. Perhaps I could show you my technique! Killed, extorted, stole. Now I die. Fuck it. I live the way I wanted. The district will probably improve from the consequences of my action. Thomas, we need you to be healthy. Not as long as I don't think you can. Goodbye for now. We're going to treat him. And then we're gonna eat him and Vampire Girl at the same time. I'm honest, I'm going on a fucking feeding frenzy, y'all. People left and right are getting snacked on right now. Hey, it's Doc, dickhead. Do you need money? Don't be ridiculous. Then you are lucky that I have taken the time to do so. Consider it a gesture of solidarity between professionals. I wish this hospital could have received as much attention from you, Dr. Reed. We do not see you in surgery very often. Shut up. Thank I'm making you healthy. Good evening. Do you require... Do you know... Despite what you... Well, at least you're... Goodbye, Mrs. I'm alright. 
Gotta keep everybody healthy. Uh, you have... What do you have? Anemia. I think I have a second anemia. Okay. Is it fucked up that I'm already viewing these people as, uh, like, cattle? Like, you know, gotta keep the cows healthy! Gonna need, uh, them to have real nice healthy blood. If my meal isn't healthy, nobody wants to eat a sick human. Fill them on up. <laughs> now I'm gonna eat fucking everybody. <laughs> Everybody's getting. Everybody's a fucking snack at this point. Oh, doctor, doctor. Don't I got a bad case of loving one. you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see, uh, who do we got? Recovering, recovering, okay, recovering. Oh, these boys, headache and a cold. Well, I can't treat the headache, but I got the cold. Recovering and recovering. These two are the next to go. Howcroft and Elwood, just need him to recover, and then that's uh, all set. Let's go treat Newton. It's cold. Oh man, let's see. Something's oh, dead end. I, I really like to get Beatrice, but being mesmerized for and all that. See, what would be interesting is if you could ignore the mesmerized levels and just snack on whoever the hell you wanted, but there was the consequence of uh, potentially like alienating people. That would be cool, because you know you'd uh, you'd sit here and just go after people in broad daylight. I mean, obviously you can overpower them. Oswald, and is that his friend? It is. Oswald, unfortunately, I can't fix headaches yet, sir. Oh, there we go. Thank you. No, what the fuck, guys? It's locked. What is this? Being buried in a mass grave for these trivialities. We are not in the middle of a battlefield anymore. Things are different here. In so many ways. Hello again, Mr. Black. I'm eternally grateful to... Do you need... For it? Throughout his... Your work... What caused your phobia of rats, Newton? It happened last year following an artillery attack. Oh, it's just a trench thing. I don't even know about that. I don't really care about these guys. They don't really seem... That important. But it's I do want to know is why they have that locked. Alright, so let's go talk to Edgar and get this story really moving. Uh, I'd like to get my mesmerize level up, like to get all these people healthy. It's about to be a fucking all you can eat vampire buffet up in this bitch. But uh, I just need uh, actually, you know what? I might be able to. Hang on. Because they're recovering pretty fast. Dude, Harriet, you would be tasty. I go to sleep. I think everyone that recovered will be better. So, I mean, just to get get a good night's rest. I do have a thousand. I'm about to net more. Nobody will notice if the crazy vampire lady is gone. Or that guy that was with her. It's just, they won't. Nobody will care. I can increase the heal off of my bite. You'll go to sleep for the night. Following night. Did 
Do you? Why not? Oh, Tippets with a fucking headache. You with the headache. And what is wrong with you? A headache? Damn it! Ugh, Thelma. I gotta find that damn treatment for headache. Let's go talk to Swansea. I didn't want to... Man, I was really hoping to snack on some people, but... And headaches. Why does everyone have a headache? Take some damn aspirin. Most common cause of headaches are you not being hydrated enough or you not eating a meal. Eat something small, have a little bit of water. Boom, headache gone. Then you're my snack. So I'm like, where is he at? Evening, Edgar. Could I get your professional opinion? Please speak. But I have something important to tell you. This strain of flu. It's very different from the one I saw in Europe. It's downright peculiar. Really? What makes you say that? I've just looked at the blood of one of our recently deceased. I see. Do you have anything more to go on? This disease spreads and looks like the Spanish flu, but its effects differ greatly. The London strain is different from the continental one. This is very interesting. Did you find something else? Yes. Unlike the flu, the infected begin to show an increase in outwardly aggressive behavior. More than simple agitation, once docile people become violent. You mean like rabies? Is there a chance we could create a vaccine, Jonathan, like Pasteur? By the stove, that would be smashing. There's a lot we're not seeing here, but it is spreading, and quickly. If we don't act, the whole city could be lost. But Jonathan, we've a fantastic opportunity sitting right here in front of us. A weapon of choice. What on earth do you mean? Why you, my dear boy? With your expertise and your blood, we could isolate the properties that course through your veins. Think about the possibilities. And why not? What did Stoker say about the children of the night? Well, using my blood. I could create a whole army of vampires. <laughs> Surely you're joking. We'll discuss this more later. Thank you for your time. No, thank you, Jonathan. But as I said, I needed to talk to you. I have some rather bad news. Yes? I'm afraid it's your sister. My sister? She's to be buried this evening at Whitechapel Cemetery. Your mother published the obituary this morning. I see. I'm sorry, Jonathan. Please accept my condolences. Well, that sucks. Poor sister. I mean, it especially sucks because she's dead because of me. So I attacked her. Because of bloodlust! How could I live with I never myself? I thought I would have to attend my murdered sister's funeral. Mary. Yeah, murdered by you. What is this event? An unknown event is I happening. I can't forgive myself. I'll find the truth about what happened to us. I swear. Something happening over this way in Whitechapel. Almost there. Pippa. Go home, sir. Look like oh, Pippa! Pippa, what the fuck, Pippa? Are you kidding me? 
Why would Pippa attack me? She don't know that I'm a vampire. Better question is why the fuck is she level 27? That's some bullshit, Pippa. Yeah, there was definitely a fucking event happening. I dropped my ultimate on her. Try to, at least. Fuck, I can't get, I can't lock on. Oh shit, it's because of the controller. thought so much better of you. What a pity. I would have liked to extract your blood. But yet here you are, fighting against me. What happened to Milton was truly regrettable, my dear, but... You were part of the problem as well, and now you're both dead. Maybe next time, do not steal from those in need of assistance. We'll find... Life won't be quite as cruel. I will say, this is making me want to do a second playthrough, one where, like, I just fucking eat everybody. Like, see, like, how bad it gets before people start noticing that, like, literally the entire town is getting just nommed down. Concerning the recruitment of new boys in Whitechapel, I think I found one. Albie, he's as stupid as a stool but tough. Ashton approved me he could get some drugs for the black market and deliver it quickly and nicely. Next time we meet, I'll tell him he's accepted as a wet boot boy and he must now meet to get the boss. I'm sure Albert would like to know he's been accepted by the wet boot boys. And if I'm not mistaken, Albert... Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so he did steal the drugs, indeed. Well, that's what you get. You shouldn't fucking steal drugs, Albert. I mean, everybody here is unhealthy, but do I really want to treat all this fatigue? Probably not. And Dorothy's still missing. Oh, now Loretta. I'll treat Loretta. She probably has some fine, delicious blood that we will save for later. But for now, we need to make our way on over to this cemetery. 
guess I could go from this way, maybe? I don't know. We're gonna save the cemetery for tomorrow, of course. But this has been a, a good episode of, uh... Decisions and murder and consequences and... Jolly good time, you could say. way and go towards the bridge and I'll probably wrap things up once I get over there but let's uh I believe Pippin just decided to become a vampire hunter I guess when she found out how Milton was murdered it makes sense bigger surprise here is the fact that she was level 27 that was pretty pretty ridiculous and a whole new district Ooh, what is that? Should I say snacks? I can't believe I'm doing this. Yes. This is a bad district. Lots of shit going on here. Box of pills. Alright, this area seems like it's fairly involved, so let's, um, wrap up here for now. It's a leech! Delicious! Now die! Pathetic. To think these mere mortals would stand a chance against me! I may be a fresh blood, but my hunger knows no match. Anyway, wrapping up here for now. Rest assured, Vampire will, of course, be continuing tomorrow. So make sure to stay tuned. Hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. And we will catch you with the next part.